Hey, what's up, YouTube? Welcome to a new video. My name is Prince Mason. Today's video is going to be a little bit exciting, you know, like a few months ago. Can't remember how long, but a few months ago, Captain One was having a conversation with me. I was having a conversation with Capture One and um, we spoke about Capture One for iPad and I was really excited about it. They gave me um, access to try it out early, but I never got to do it. And it was because one key feature was missing that I really wanted and that was tethering. I wanted to be able to shoot directly from my camera into Capture One and they were like, oh, it's not available. It's going to come out in a few months. So even though I had the opportunity to actually use it, um, I didn't want to come on here and talk to you guys about something that uh or features that i probably was not really like going to use even though i was excited that capture one for ipad had finally come out he had to start his car in the middle of this <sighs> even though i was excited that capture one for um ipad was finally out the major feature i wanted was not in there so i didn't really try it out but now you can tether from your camera both wirelessly and with a tether cable to your ipad and that is freaking interesting to me so now i do not have to carry this and this to a shoot i can just go with this slick in it so that's what we're going to talk about today by the way today's video is sponsored by capture one like i said it's always nice when a software that you use all the time wants to sponsor one of your videos so freaking excited so let's talk about capture one and right now what i'm going to do before i go out and shoot because i'm shooting out in the field what i'm going to shoot today i don't know but i'm going to go out with like a few friends take a few pictures show you guys how this works but what i want to do right now is just connect my camera to this i have connected it wirelessly and it worked a little slow because <laughs> my files are 45 megapixels and I, I mean i don't expect magic right now but what i'm going to do is connect this wire take a picture see how it works and i'm going to go out buy a new tether cable and after getting a new tether cable i'm going to go because i don't have one i've not been shooting tethered at home so after getting a new tether cable i'm going to go to school and i'll have a photo shoot in school I'll show you guys exactly how that goes so chop chop let's get straight into today's video Model. I'm not. <laughs> I'm not. That's Joe, our model for today. And this is Hello. Connor. Connor is our cinematographer today. <laughs> right? Yes, sir. Why are you running? I look at her like an assistant. <laughs> She's dying. She's freezing, bro. That's a lion assistant today. Yes. Yes. Close the jacket, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, no, go, go. Okay, look at the camera now. Hey, put your glasses down. Listen to, listen to uh, our technical director. <laughs> listen, to, <laughs> listen to our technical director. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, that. Yeah. Probably just look up. Right there. Oh my god. Yeah, and the light has to be here, no. bro. On this, this side? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> it's like, it's like, I can't believe they go to school for this. <laughs> <laughs> it's like a full production. Yeah, move back a bit. Sorry. Yeah, you have to point the light at this face. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Okay, what she she wants to pose you. Bro, <laughs> really? <laughs> yeah. 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 Okay, so the amazing thing is we are actually getting instant feedback, even though this is 45 megapixels. 
it's 45 megapixels but we're getting instant feedback so every time i shoot from here immediately it goes into like my ipad and it's nice because you can really see everything and people around you can actually look and say i know it's loud because it's windy i hope you guys can hear me but yeah um we're getting decent pictures right now i'm shooting at like 1 5000 of a second 1.4 iso 100 and i'm using the godox 8300 so we're getting about like maybe one one over two that's what the power is so it looks looks nice okay so yeah pause bro she said like this okay she said look that way bro it, no, no. She, no 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 wait yeah. yeah either way yeah yeah but i prefer you look this way towards the light okay. yeah yeah Yan. <laughs> Yan, come on that's hard that is hard bro that is hard bro you look i'm looking like you look like this here, bro. You can use these pictures for the next five years. <laughs> yeah, for this photo shoot. Right? I'm not, helping you. No, you're yeah, directing. Yan, Yan, the light has to be like here. Yeah, it looks light. decent. Yeah. Like only the light. Yeah. Only the light. Can you say cover the whole thing? Gee, that's so cool. So wait, She's I don't put the light on him. You are. Huh? What would Tiki say? Light and everything up. Yeah. I hope we get paid for this. <laughs> that was nice. That was really nice. That was really nice. Okay, that was fine. Nice. I really like this one. Which one? This one. That's that's that one and this one. Oh my god. These ones. Oh. And these ones. Okay. We are good. Do you want to say? Go ahead. No, go ahead. It's warm. That's why. I'm it's warm. Like, oh oh. <laughs> okay. Okay. This. We are good. Yeah, good to go? Yes. Nice. Russell, you want, you want to, you know, go, go, go there with the jacket. Go there with the jacket. Go there with the jacket. I look all blessed, friend. Go there with the jacket. Jan, why are you not going there with the I look homeless. Jan, the light's too high for her. Let's not make any more. No, no, no. What do you mean? I brought a clone. Look at it. <laughs> okay, we can go and play soccer now. I feel like the umbrella. <laughs> <laughs> Look at it's you! So nice. It's Look, so nice. Look like a Bollywood model. <laughs> So guys, just go back home and I'm exhausted because after the photo shoot, I had to go for soccer practice. But there are a few things that I want to talk about with Capture One for iPad that um, I don't know that I absolutely love. But if I did, I want to say big shout out to my classmate for coming through, man. You guys rock. Big shout out to Connor for the behind the scenes too, man. Thank you so much. But anyways, let's get straight to this because I don't want to waste like too much time here. Um, absolutely love it. Capture One for iPad is amazing. Like. Ooh. She almost dropped it, <laughs> my iPad. But um, it's crazy how fast um, it is because considering these are raw files and just how fast it is going through these raw files and creating previews for these raw files is it's actually crazy. Um, by the way, you know, like the, the iPad is like really powerful, but you know, the, the fact that they've made it so, I don't know, work so well with this, you know, it's, it's just it's just really amazing. Like having another screen or having like a bigger screen to use when you're having your photo shoots and you have like your um, people that work with you. Uh, maybe you have a shoot with a client and your client can go through it. It's just like on, on a big screen like this is just good. The fact that you can review your focus immediately and know if your images are in focus or if they're not, you know, on the bigger screen. And, and you know, the screens on these iPads are like really, really good. Like looking at these images i'm just like damn these things look good right so yeah the, like having those things and those options are just really amazing like the only downside i can say about this is just carrying like an extra thing you know as a photographer most people just like to go out and shoot as simple as they want but if you're on set you know commercial shoots your personal uh, um, portrait shoots you and you need like a bigger screen um and you can tell it directly to your to your ipad brah it's, it's it's really amazing um now now to counter that on the capture one website i can see like maybe tele tools i don't know i'm just saying you know off the top of my head 
they have this like sling that you can use to hang your iPad on your side and then you know when you shoot you can go in check it and and, and then you know just leave it hanging on your side that's going to be like a really nice um, addition and probably something that I'm definitely going to look like again so right now um, I can upload these images into the cloud so Capture One allows you to upload a thousand images into the cloud um, but I'm not going to do that because I'm home. So I'm just going to plug in like uh, a hard drive, export everything, all the images I've worked on to a hard drive and then take to my PC and just work on these um, images from my PC. And whatever settings I have on here will always will still remain when I move them to my PC. So, I mean, this is like a really good option and I'm really excited. Finally, my iPad is it's going to get good use and I don't need to have a 128 gig iPad again. Now you can go for the 512s, the one terabytes and two terabyte um, iPads and, and your memory will actually like um, be for good use. And this is just amazing. So big shout out to Capture One for making this happen. Absolutely love this. Big shout out to Capture One for sponsoring this video. If you guys want to jump on this, there'll be a link in the description below. Definitely get yourself that link so you can get Capture One for iPad. Anyways, thank you so much for watching today's video and I'll see you guys in the next one. <laughs> Capture one fire pad. Tetrin. Mind blown. Mind blown. Anyways, I'll see you guys in the next video. Have an amazing day. Peace out, guys.